Hey everybody, my name is Caitlin and welcome to my channel, The Bobbin Weave. Today I'll be working on sewing up some pelican totes. I was cleaning my craft room and I came across these unfinished pelican tote bags. There's four of them. I think I was working on these for a craft show last year that got canceled and then I just forgot about them. But all of the front pieces and the back pieces are sewn together and has a zipper pocket and I also fused the foam on it so these just need my labels here and then the um, corners need to be uh, need to have a dart in them and then I need to finish up the lining I don't have the zipper pockets on those yet and then I also have to do the straps but a lot of it's already done for me, so I'm going to try and knock these out tonight. So, we'll see how that goes. Oh, and before I get started, I just wanted to apologize for my smoke alarm going off last week. Uh, the battery needed to be changed, and I have that taken care of now, so I do apologize for that. So, spoiler alert, it did not take me one night to finish these bags. It took about a week. I did not have as much time to sew as I would like, but in the end, I did get there and got them finished in time for the craft show. So, I'm just starting off by attaching my wooden name tags to the front panels of the bags, and then I will move on to sewing the darts in the corners.
So this is as far as I got the first night of sewing. It was really late and I was tired so I just decided to call it a night. But now it's a couple of days later and I am working on the straps. And I am just folding these in half and then folding that in half again and putting clips because I despise ironing and I will do anything not to iron because that usually end up burning my hands. So this way um, was just easier and um, that way I didn't burn my hands. So I am sewing these up and then attaching them to the bags and then I will sew the exterior back piece to the exterior front piece.
So now that all of the exterior pieces are sewn together, I'm going to be working on the lining pieces. And first off, I'm going to be sewing the zipper pockets. And I am using a number five zipper, so I'm doing a half inch opening for that pocket. On the first one, I did what the pattern called for, and I think the pattern calls for a number three zipper, so it was just a little bit too small, so I just corrected that on the rest of them.
it's the next day now and I'm just going to finish up the other two zipper interior pockets and then I will move on to the snap tab closures.
So I just found the centers of each lining piece and attached the tab closure to those and now I will be working on sewing up the darts. So now that all of the lining pieces have the darts in them, it's time to sew the front and back lining pieces together. And I'm just making sure that the darts meet up and clipping those around. And you don't have to leave an opening in the bottom of these because we will pull the bag out through the zipper pocket. The lining pieces have been sewn together so now it is time to sew the lining to the exterior and I was going to try to do it this way with the bag um, right side out inside of the lining but the lining was a little bit too snug for me to fit that around nicely so I had to take the exterior out and turn it around and then also turn the lining inside out and put it inside the bag and it fit much better that way.
I've made sure all of the top edges look good and so that you can't see any of the lining sticking out of it. And now I am just turning the bag inside out to top stitch. I just find it a little bit easier that way.
Okay, so these are finally finished. It took over a week now. Um, I am loving this one so much. All of the different colors. But we have four to take to the craft show that is on Saturday. And make sure you're subscribed to my channel because the next video I will be showing what all I'm taking to the craft show. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.